all of you. Hi, this is Joseph Israel. I'm going to just uh, play some keys, uh, very simple keys that I will show you, and uh, you will be able to see how to use your um, different uh, fingers, you know, and then specifically with few keys, only three keys, three major keys um, we're going to use for this specific tutorial. So if you're ready, let's go. So you see, you will be using the B, that's the B key, the C key, and the G. Now, with those three notes, you will use your left fingers, so your left hands, and you will do the chords of, which is A minor, and the next for the progression that will be, which is the F chord, and then, which is the G chord, that will be your E minor. So let me just play it, and then we come back and we will see how to break it down. So, very simple, but what you got to understand is you're only using this key, which is the, um, the, the, the B key, and the C, and the G. So you put them together, and you do your progression very easy, very slow, that will give you a sound, and you go. So, you start. So I'm going to take off the video so you can see better on my fingers. So you go this way, all together, right? Now the same key, which is the G over here, why don't you keep your two fingers on the B and the C? You will move, swap if you want, move your G over here. So that will give you G, B, and C. That's the same key. But the only difference is that you bring in another note, another sound. Okay, so we go.
That's how you go. Very simple key. Your B, C, and G. And then on your left fingers, you have your A, your C, and your E. That gives you the chord for A minor. And then after you have your F minor, which is F. Okay, so you have F, and then you have your A, and then you have a C, which is your F uh, chord. And then after you have your G, so which is G, B, D. So this is your G chord. And then this is your E minor. So you have E, you have um, G, and then the B that gives you your G minor. So that's how it goes. We go and play one more time, okay? So you put your fingers, the more comfortable that you are, as you can. And eventually one thing that you also can do is uh, to add on your keyboard a jewel that will bring in something different that will be more kind of like a, uh, a second voice over your piano. So let's see how it sounds. So that's pretty much it, what you have to do 
on uh, making uh, different ways of playing it. You can uh, play in a different direction, you know, and um, different ways. Uh, let's, for example, you go, instead of going up, you can just go down, you see, or just uh, do a random, you see. So if you go this way, Okay, so that's mainly how you're going to use your different fingers to play on this one. Another way also of playing a soaking spiritual melody based on the, some known um, uh, chords, that will be uh, the El Shaddai, okay, the El Shaddai. So we're going to, um, to play the El Shaddai together and we see how it's going to sound. You have your D and then over here you come, you, you start counting from your D, your E, and then your F. So it goes. You see? So now you can uh, make few arrangement. So it goes. Okay, so one more time. You want to go faster, okay? Now, this is a little kind of like a all over, but you know, the main idea is to be able to play in a way where you can control your flow. And this is something that you can learn progressively. You go with the speed, very slow, and after you go faster. So if you go slow, It's a way of playing this simple song. So again, 
thank you for watching and uh, we will be for the next video on something else bye bye